is this registrate of a trademark worth it? Let's talk about it in this video. It's important to know when you um, want to build a brand. It's important to know what trademark is and what it can do for your brand. So what we're going to discuss is how the process is of trademark and what you need to consider before you register a trademark and think about if it's worth it or not. I'm also give you some example. So um, let's go to the whiteboard. What you need to know is when you register a trademark, you have to go to a process. And after the process, so when I say it's a P, after the process, you will get a trademark. So here, this is the beginning. And when you go there, you will get a trademark. It did cost a lot of money, right? And what people don't realize is, when you get the trademark, it's just a right. You need to think about managing and also protecting your brand. And that's something that people always forget before they register a trademark and what will happen then if someone is using a trademark and you do not try to protect it it can damage your trademark that's something that you need to consider and what you need to know is register a trademark is different than managing your trademark and when you get a trademark you can take action you can take action to protect your trademark but even that costs money so if you are planning to protect even that cost money because you have to hire an advisor a lawyer doesn't matter but you have to pay them and they will send a letter and that costs money so we have two things here registration costs money and protection costs money and the reason why i'm saying this is uh, the thing is people register a trademark but after a while they do not do anything with it they do not manage they neglect their um, obligation and what happened with the trademark you just register for nothing and you can say bye bye to your investment it's that simple so um let me give you on a, a case a normal case um let's uh, go back let's erase this so the thing is um in Holland we had a client and the client registered a trademark so he had a trademark but it was in 2014 yeah in 2017 he came to me and said, hey, listen, some people are using my trademark. But there were three years he didn't do anything with the trademark. So he didn't manage, he didn't protect it, anything. And the trademark that he registered was, let's say he, he did it himself and it was, um, the registration wasn't that good. And the problem with that is when a registration is like that, you cannot protect your brand so what I'm trying to say is when you register a trademark think before you register and think about your product or services because his registration was the, he had a trademark but the trademark that he had for his product or service wasn't really clear and I was convinced that when uh, we try to take action he wouldn't win yeah. So it wasn't based only on the date, but also the trademark itself, the way how it registered, it wasn't that good. Because he did it himself without some, any advice, he just followed some videos online. And the problem with that is, when it goes wrong, it goes wrong, and it happened. So someone used his trademark, and uh, he wanted to take action. I was honest with him, I said, listen, the time you're going to invest in this, you're not going to get anything back from it and the uh, um, party that he wanted to take action against didn't have enough money so there was enough reason for him not to take action because he's not going to get his investment back but the thing of the story is when you have a trademark make sure you register it correct and after register make sure you're going to maintain it because if you neglect that it's gonna hurt you really hard and the reason why I'm saying that is sometimes you have startups they want to start a business they want to build a brand everything yeah everybody's positive everything but people forget when you register a trademark you need to also maintain it if you do not maintain it it can cost you because if you do not maintain it that's 
an investment that you're making you're not getting the money back so is it worth it register a trade market i would say no especially if you're a startup at the beginning the first six months don't do that focus on building your product and services and later your brand what i'm saying that is because if you want to register something and you're not planning to manage it don't do that it's not worth it but if you um, interested in register but also manage the brand the trademark register if you have enough money to do that do that hey, i would advise you to do that but if you don't have enough money and you need to focus on your product or services don't focus too much on the ip focus on bringing up the, um, the product and later you can protect it with ip yes a lot of people are saying you need to register ip here first but if you're not planning to manage it what's what's the what's the what's the benefit of it so the thing about how i see it so it's my opinion the thing is when you do something when you invest something you need to get your money back if you don't worthless it's that simple so that's my view about it trademark registration if you if you have deep pockets and you're really serious about managing your trademark register if you don't have deep pocket and uh, you're not serious about managing your trademark don't register it's not worth it so i see you in the next video